Hey guys, welcome to part 47. Last episode, we found Goron City kind of an abandoned waste. However, I want to see something. So, I'm going to be right back. We're going to run back to Temple of Time. Okay, so, here we go. Alright, Temple of Time. Oh, hi, Sheik. What's up? You destroyed the wicked creatures that haunted the temple and awakened the sage. Yes, I did. But there are still other sages who need your help. In order to awaken all the other sages, you must become even more powerful. Yep. You must travel over mountains, underwater, and even through that one subway. What? And even through time. If you want to return to your original time, return the Master Sword to the pedestal of time. Of time. By doing this of time, you will travel back in time seven years of time. Thanks, Sheik. The time will come when you will have to return here quickly. I will teach this to you for when that time comes. Yes. The song to return you to the Temple of Time. The Prelude of Light. Excuse me. Nice heart, by the way. Do 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 Alright Do 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 Whoa hey What's the little ball of light? What is with that? Oops, that was weird. What's with the ball of light? You have learned the prelude of light. As long as you hold the Ocarina of Time and the Master Sword, you hold time itself in your hands. Link, we shall meet again. No, she can you please help me out with the things that ah thanks. Alright. The reason I wanted to check on this was because we need to go back to the three dungeons that we did as a kid and finish them completely. So the next part of this episode, it's gonna be a little jumpy, but we're just gonna like hop to all the things that we haven't done before. Most of it is gold skulltillas. And not really hero of time. I mean, I'm only teleported seven years. Anyway, let's head first to the Deku tree. All right. All right, yuck. You see a small amount of soft soil here. Never really got to show you what these magic beans are meant for. There. See, that's what magic beans are meant for. All right, sorry. Back again to the Deku Tree. Hi, Deku Tree. Sorry about your death. Sorry to hear that. All right, All right here we are in the Deku Tree. Floor two, you can see in the end of that hallway. Last time, we had a bunch of rocks up here that we really didn't have anything to do with. We couldn't do anything. So, I'm going to use up one of my precious bomb shoes and blow them up. Like that. Up, 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 up. And there we go. I can't aim. I really don't want to waste any more of these bomb shoes. You know, I, when I first played Ocarina of Time... You know, obviously, since I haven't played Ocarina of Time Master Quest before, I used to hate bomb shoes. I thought they were worthless, and like everyone just kind of like overrated them. No, they're very valuable now. <laughs> Mostly because I don't have any of them anymore. Alright. There's still another Skulltilla in here somewhere. So, and a chest. So, we need to get there next. Alright. Here we are in the other part, in basement one. We see the Song of Time box, which irritated me to no end earlier, because we couldn't do anything about it. Now we can do something about it. I really hope. Really hope. What if I'm wrong? I don't know. And nothing happens, you fool. Chest. Probably like five bucks. Okay, that's pretty good. Fifty bucks. I'll take that. Alright, there's still more Skulltillas to find, though, so let's keep going. Alright, here I am in still in basement one in this little corner room. I'm actually going to get the bomb chews out of there just so I don't accidentally use them. 
Plus, I need to do this anyway. We need to kill this big Deku. Deku Baba. There we go. Which just leaves you all alone with me. There we go. Alright, is that all of them? Nope, there's still more. Look, there's myrrh. Alright. Gotta keep looking. Ah! Found it! Took me a little while. Alright, see the room I'm in? Basement one? It's right up there. A little jerky took me forever. Fortunately, it might be too high for me to reach. This might be a little bit of an issue. Alright, give me a second. I gotta kill these things, and then I gotta figure out a way to get up there. That was cool. Alright, so note to self, when, if Navi ever decides to just kind of stand in a spot, you know, glowing green, you sit there and go, I don't know what to do now. We now know why. So supposed to be one there, too? Okay, this apparently Song of Time stuff's a lot better than I gave it credit for. Or well, at least it's being used a lot more deviously. I never really expected Navi just to suddenly go, I feel certain something right here. I'll, I'll play my, you know, Telltale song. That does everything. I mean, this is really impressive. How would, oh, oops. How is average Joe Schmo supposed to figure this out? Yes! Please tell me it's the last one. Yes! Last one! Finally! Alright, I'm getting out of this nut job of a place. Next place we're gonna head to is the Dongo's Cavern. Just give me a second, I gotta escape out of this place. Ah! Wrong! Wrong way! Give me a moment to escape, then we're gonna go to the Dongo's Cavern. Figure out the rest of the gems there. The gems, the stuff. Look, it's another patch of dirt. Check. Small amount of soil. Alright. That would have been there, too. Oops. Cool. Alright. To the Doggo's Cavern. Hopefully this one will go a little quicker. Alright. Here we are, Dongo's Cavern, that little side room right there. Now to get rid of all these stupid Song of Time blocks. What? Hang on, let me try that again. There we go. Huh? Really? I will find you! This is stupid! Why don't they all just go away? No, one at a time. Ah, fine. Oh wait, was that him? Whoa! Hello.
I will find you. Bingo! Finally! I can't tell if that's just those things, or if that's actually another gold school tiller, which would actually be pretty clever. So, I'm gonna kill them both. There's another one. Okay, come on. Come on now. Let's keep on going. This is really ridiculous. Dude, my lips are hurting since I have to play this song like 50 million times. Oh, I get it. This is a normal one. Okay, no more? That normal one was meant to fake you out. Alright, I don't think there's any more. Let's see, there's still some gold skulltillas in here. Alright, so let's keep searching. There he is! Ah! Cause I'm getting into sleepiness mode, I'm just like, numb, numb, sleepy. He's right there! Now I just need to grab the prize. Please be the last one! Yes! Thank goodness! Alright, now let's head to Lord Jabu Jabu's belly. I really don't want to go there again. It's gross! And nasty. Oh. Now I go sleepy. Why I go sleepy? I don't know. I'll go sleepy. Anyway, let's head to Jabu Jabu's. Let's head to Jabu's palace. Oh, 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 oh. There was a Skulltilla there. I'm not taking this. Oh, my nose. I'm not taking this. I knew it! Stupid. Dang! Stupid thing is stupid. Alright, sorry. Continue to Lord Jabu Jabu's belly. Alright, here we are. Inside Lord Jabu Jabu's belly. Room right before the boss. Remember, this one was giving us a lot of grief, and I think I know how to get it. If not, I'm gonna be sad. There we go! Awesome! Apparently the boomerang was needed to curve around it. Alright, now is that all of them? Of course not. Alright, let's keep searching. Alright. Here's this one room that we couldn't understand earlier because it had like invisible stuff. I mean, it was just weird. Still don't even really know it's about. I'm thinking we can fire it. Oh. oh. 
Oh. What? Oh. I was just hit by a fire key right there. Yes, you were. I couldn't see it, but it could still hurt me. Yes. Like it's about to right now. There's nothing here to allow me to get across. And oh. I think we still can't get this. What? I think it's still unavailable to us. So why'd you come here? Cause I thought it wouldn't. All right, so. With that, let's head back to Golan Land. Yep. Yeah, I'm sorry, I thought we could. But we're, I think we need to get an item that we, that I'm not going to get yet. Cause we, well, I could. But I shouldn't. You know what I mean? Alright, so let's head back to Goron Land real quick. And then we'll finish up this episode. She. Yeah! Teleportation of What the? What is that? Oh cool, that's what the magic bean turns into. <coughs> well that's pretty stinking sweet. It's like a little quickie thing. Wait a second. Height! <laughs> yes! All right. I mean, is that total nine? It's pretty sweet. All right, so don't you sell. Plant more magic beans everywhere. That's nice. I like that. All right, back to Goron City. That was a lot. In real life time. That took me an hour just to run around, search the dungeon completely to find it. So now on the next episode, we can really figure out what's going on with the Gorons, because. They're all gone. We don't know what happened to them. So, see you then.